for today's video, I decided to go and play every game my own, and the second game that I'm going to be playing on my channel is... Dead Space is a science fiction horror franchise created and directed by Glenn Schofield. Dead Space was developed by Visceral Games and published and owned by Electronic Arts, or basically EA. So what we know about Dead Space is that the game is set in a 26th century science fiction universe featuring environments, weapons, and characters typical of the genre. The Dead Space franchise centers on a series of video games beginning with the release of the first one, which is basically called Dead Space. Pretty obvious, right? Which is the main character named Isaac Clarke, who is a starship engineer without realizing there were mutated undead horrors that were surrounding him. So based off what we know about Dead Space, it was mainly starting off as Isaac Clarke who has joined a search and rescue team for the USG Ishimura, which has gone radio silent. After receiving a message from his girlfriend Nicole, their ship suffered damage while attempting to dock the Ishimura. While the rest of the crew decided to like really don't want to be there anymore, it was up to Isaac to go and explore the ship to look for Nicole. But as what we know, the ship was overrun by necromorphs, forcing Isaac to defend himself by weaponizing his mining tools and basically whatever resources on his amazing spacesuit. Like, my god. But throughout the campaign, it seemed to be that Isaac was experiencing really different visions of recurring of Nicole. That was mainly because of the red markers. And of course, it completely really sabotaged the entire crew except Isaac because somehow he managed to really get out of it. The good news about Dead Space was that it was received so positively that people absolutely loved the game. And most people call it one of the best horror games out there. Which might be true, I'm not really too sure. But for what Glenn Schofield has done, honestly, well done to the team and also him as well for creating one of the best, like, horror games out there. But instead of playing the original Dead Space, we could be playing the remake version. Because this game sh my pants. God damn right. So as what we know about Dead Space Remake, it was developed by Motive Studio and also published by EA. So that was pretty obvious. So Dead Space was released on the PlayStation 5, Windows and Xbox Series X and S on January 27th, 2023. Which was the first release in the Dead Space series since 2013. Which was like, oh my god, almost 10 years ago. EA announced a remake of Dead Space in July 2021 to be developed by EA's Motive studios and that team did such an amazing job by rebuilding all the systems from scratch and they were also introducing new features like dynamic lighting to make it more scarier but what we know about the Dead Space remake it was received so positive that the reviews from the critics was just amazing because what we know about the reviews it got an 89 out of 100 on Metacritic and got an 8.8 .8 out of 10 which is like oh my god man but besides that we're gonna go into a new game plus and I hope you guys enjoy I don't know if I want to play this. All right, let's do it. New Game Plus. Starting a new Game Plus will carry weapons, items, credits, and upgrades from your complete playthrough. They'll give you a treat for the story or any story you can get to. You can expect to face new enemies and perhaps new mysteries to uncover. Well, thanks, really. Dude, I remember when I first played Dead Space Remake from like almost a year ago. I did play the original when I was a little bit more younger, but playing the actual remake last year, my God, I loved it. Like when I heard about the remake coming out, I was like, thank you. After that disaster, I played Callisto Protocol. Hey, if you want to see a video of that? Let me know down in the comments. USG Ishimura. This is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kelly responding to your distress call. Come in, Ishimura. Yeah, no one's gonna talk, buddy. Only if they knew what happened. If only they knew. Sometimes I wish it would be really cool if they had made like a prequel from Dead Space of actually what was going on inside the ship before we arrived. I don't know if there's actually something like that, but at the same time, my god. Oh no, what are we gonna do? Ah! Yeah, blue light, go and get that. <laughs> Oh yeah, for my- oh my god, that looks so good! Chapter 1, New Arrivals. Yeah, welcome to Dead Space! My name's Jonathan, FPS. Or, just Jonathan, without the FPS, you know. But what about all of you guys? Have you played Dead Space or even the remake? Let me know down in the comments down below. I did ask most of you about that Dying Light 2 video, which if you haven't watched it already, please do so. And my god, that video did so well. So honestly, thank you all for the love and support on my previous video. Thank you all so much. And if you're watching this right now, thank you so much. I really appreciate you, so I'll be just gonna be walking like normal but dude looking at the graphics right now this game looks so beautiful man man single player games are so much more better than multiplayer games nowadays looking at you cool judy <laughs> Ah, caca. 
To be honest, I am glad that they added a voice acting on Isaac Clarke in the remake because, I mean, the first one was just, like pretty oh. good, man. Like, don't get me wrong. It's like what I always say. This is how you do a remake. Keep it to like sort of like the original storyline, but make it a little bit different, but not too different, if that makes any sense. You're done playing around. You're done playing around. I'm playing the bloody game. Well, I can tell you that the the whole thing is absolutely fucked. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Man, I hope nothing bad happens. Oh my god. Oh fuck. Okay, you guys have fun with that. I'm out of here. How do I run? How do I run? What button is it to run? Oh fuck, I'm, I'm, I'm stupid. I am running. What do you fucking want me to do? Press the button. Oh fuck. Come and get me, bitch. Yeah, go and fuck yourself. Ah, oh, after that lovely trip of me being with all blood. Oh my god, look at that bloody face, though. <laughs> Honestly, if this was real life, I would sh my pants. Okay, I need a gun. Ah, the good old plasma cutter. Such a classic right there. I think I'll be fine using that tool right there. Okay, crew member. Okay, I'm coming. I hope, I hope nothing bad happens. <laughs> okay, okay, trip. First kill. Is that a thing? Oh, no, it's a male. Okay. Hello. I bet there's gonna be enough there. Oh, f oh shit! That, that oh, dude. Oh, then my headset was up so loud. I need to turn that down. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. Hey, there we go. It's my friend. It still gets me wondering about: Are they going to remake Dead Space 2? Because if they do that, man, oh my god. Because I mean, it was a pretty damn good game. But I heard that like some lake or something said that EA might not be doing that because like Dead Space didn't sell well. And it's like there's a difference between on single player games and multiplayer games. I mean, what multiplayer games make bloody like crap load of money. Single player games make their money. I understand where they're coming from. But hey, if you guys agree with that, let me know down in the comments down below. Okay, let me save my game. When was the last time I played this? Oh, the 2nd of May, 2023, I played this. Oh, wow. My first attempt was back on the 29th of January. Oh, okay. And I'm playing it again in 2024 because it's only been eight days in this year. And my God, I love this year so far. I know there's no power there. So I know there's going to be some of the things coming around. <laughs> die. Please die. <laughs> then I clicked the correct one and I found out there was a storage room. And of course I wasn't stealing, right? Um... Oh my god, my bloody chair. Hang on, let me just put my chair back up. Better. You know, I think it would be a cool idea to go and play this on the hardest difficulty. If you guys want to see that, let me know down in the comments. This absolutely sucks. One more kill. So satisfying getting kills like that. Okay, that, that's a weird noise. Where is it? Oh, I, oh never mind. <laughs> Well, at least I now know there's actually side missions on this bloody playthrough because this whole time uh, when I played it for the first time, I just went for the campaign and didn't realize it was side mission. <laughs> oh, I don't know if I can trust this. Let me just go. <laughs> oh my god, this guy. Can you die? Okay, I just need to turn the power off. Oh, yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, turn the lights off. Yeah, that's fine. I'm not gonna lie, but whoever did the sound effects and the audio, man, God bless you. You know how to. <laughs> I hope there's someone behind me, I swear to god. I bloody hear them. I like when Dead Space 1 and 2 came out, it actually made sense until Dead Space 3 came, and it's like, what the heck, what did they do to it? Look at that, you EA. Ooh. Oh, that was easy, okay. <gasps> I hate this so much. Can you die, for god's sake? Oh, sh- oh, oh. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Okay. Okay, let's go to the bench. Uh, I mean, I've already buffed up my whole suit anyway. Plasma cutter, pulse rifle, ripper, flamethrower, line gun, contact beam, and force gun. Yeah, this is upgrading my plasma. This is what I like about New Game Plus. At least you can, like, keep your actual upgrades. Oh, look at you, buddy. Hey, buddy. Was that one bullet? How does that make any sense how, like, some enemies take forever to kill when all of a sudden, like, one enemy is, like, one bullet dead? Oh, it's pretty quiet now. <gasps> oh, fuck! I hear one on my bloody right, I swear. Oh my luck, there's gonna be a bloody enemy. Told ya. <laughs> then once I put in the data board, I realized I had to go and fix a bloody tram, so that was bloody fun. Okay, you have to go through all that. Let's go to the tram tunnel. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Man, that sound effect just went. Ooh, that's mine. All right. Okay, go for there, baby. Oh, of course, that was close. Okay. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, fuck. Okay. 
I found a man inside the vents. Yeah, he, yeah, he dead. Yeah, he's dead. Man, that poor soul. Well, I'm just here collecting stuff. <laughs> Everyone's like just down on the floor and Esmega's like, oh, piece of candy. Okay, I need to maybe press a button. Oh, I know what to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still can't get over bloody Isaac Clark's bloody outfit, man. Look at that. <gasps> Okay, anyway, so we're gonna do this one, the quest Y. Okay, now there's gonna be another bloody enemy that's gonna swap my ass. Yep, what an absolute shocker that is. Okay, get out. <laughs> okay, man, that was like a one shot in the head. Honestly, to the team that has remake this game, good on you, man. It was like what I said earlier about how underwhelming Callisto Protocol was and of how much hype that game actually got, but turned out to not really be that, like, good. It was still a good game, but not really what we were expecting. But compared to now, it's like, oh, baby. Yeah, because Callisto Protocol came out in December, I believe, about like a month before. Before this came out by playing this like the bloody dead space like, of course it's gonna be better like my god well i mean go through all that at least we can call the tram now and hopefully i can get my new equipment that i've already earned I wonder how hot he would be in this outfit like it's all like bronze and whatever else it's on it but still bloody good man like compared to the original like this is just a big improvement like 101 okay looks like we're gonna return to the keelion oh i don't know what's gonna happen i really hope nothing is gonna be bad about this i really hate that bloody noise right now i do not like horror games but i like how we went through absolute hell when I'm gonna go back to the bloody ship to tell the bloody whoever else is on the ship. Like, they're like a bloody Sunday cruise and all of a sudden I'm like, get me out of here. Man, that doll's bloody creepy, man. Oh, I do mean it is a horror game, so uh, it, yeah. I don't know if she knows right now, but this is a really bad idea. We've got a problem. <laughs> like, I'm so chilled. I like how unenthusiastic she is. Uh-oh. How the hell do they know about that? Man, they're way smarter than me. Well, I I got okay. Well, uh, okay, it still gets me wondering if I should ever get into video game designing, but at the same time, I'm not really too sure anymore. New game plus inventory. Retrieve inventory and weapons from the storage section. Oh my god, thank you. I thought I already purchased that. Oh my god, how much stuff do I have? So while I was scrolling through the shop, oh my god, that's blinding. Anyway, so I bought more stuff for myself and also sold stuff, and all of a sudden I was running around the whole ship, and I don't know what the heck I'm doing anymore. So I can't get the level 6 outfit at the moment, even though I do have it on my last new game plus, so that's that makes sense. Maybe because I didn't really... Okay, I'll shut up. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Flamethrower, let's do it. It's cool that they done, like, a survival horror because you've got to be so careful on your ammo, man. But I think that's what made Dead Space, like, really bloody good, man. Like, no wonder why this game won so many rewards and Glenn Schofield was so praised on his creation that he has done. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Oh, right. Chapter 1 completed. Hell yeah. Let me just move that here. Let me just put that one over here. Security officer. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus, man. I don't know if I should do it, but I have to do it. Holy crap, there's a lot of body bags right there. So most of the gameplay was me just walking around and also being a little bit more scared than usual. Then I saw somebody banging their head on a glass window, so I have no idea what the heck that was about. I, uh, buddy, I don't know if you want to do that. kind of reminds me of what like Doom 3 was like as well. It's like you're just going around seeing how everything is going completely downhill and you just go, yeah, okay. At the same time, whose idea was it to like do research on things that can kill you? May you fall. Oh, that's really cool. I like this. I'm really trippy as well. Like, what the hell? I wonder how long this took the developers to get this done, man. Well, it took them quite a while to get this over and done with. Oh, it's like those, like, really confusing missions as well. It's like, how the hell do developers even, like, go through that? I mean, to be honest, I would stay in here. CO2. I'm gonna sit here and just spam the A button. <laughs> Dude, that would be bloody scary. I'm doing what I can. Oh, my God, man. Okay, okay see you later. What the hell? <laughs> Where's every time I say something, the power turns off in this bloody game. What's all with these bloody red ones? Oh, hang on. I didn't use my flamethrower. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that is so satisfying. I talked about the flamethrower earlier. Now I haven't even bloody used it. Burn, baby, burn. <laughs> oh, that's so satisfying. Oh, my God, they keep coming. Oh. My god. How the heck did that guy survive for that long? I didn't realize these were humans in there. Oh my god. What the heck were they doing here?
<laughs> oh yeah. Take the explosive charge or don't mind me. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's dead. Wonder what's gonna happen now. <laughs> okay, I just realized what that said. We have run out of body bags. Yeah, I think that's gonna be it for chapter one. Well, everybody, that is going to be the video for today. Thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate every single one of you that have reached to the very end. Thank you so much. And also, if you guys haven't subscribed today, please do so because the support on this channel has been incredible so far. So if you guys want to subscribe, I really appreciate that. And if you guys want to check out my social medias, they're all down in the description down below. Besides that, everybody, my name's Jonathan. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and night. And I will see you guys in my next video.